Hey guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Risky. Today is going to be a bittersweet video because it's going to be the last time I'm going to do a video on my 328i. We've sold it. So, um, it's okay because I will be getting another car. It'll most likely going to be another BMW. I don't know which one just yet, but you guys just have to just stay tuned and find out. Today, I'm just going to finish off the last video of the 328i by showing you everything that I've done to this car. So, it's it's a bittersweet video because I love this car. I love this car too, to bits, um, but it, it just has to be done, guys. So, without further ado, let's show you the things that I've done to the 328i. So starting off with the engine mods, we've done VRSF kiteless downpipe, custom catback exhaust, a GFB diverter valve, FTP turbo inlet, and finally got the BM3 on the stage to 98 octane. With all these mods guys, the car sounds great, so take a listen. Next up is the interior mods, quite simple really guys, I've only done the leather wrap M Sport steering wheel, the gloss black radio surround with LED lights and all the interior panels is wrapped in the carbon fiber wrap, like I said pretty simple. Next we have the exterior mods, we've got carbon front lip with the M3 style front grille. It just gives it that more aggressive look that I want. Also, we've got the carbon M style mirror cap, carbon lip spoiler, and also we've got the VLAN tail light with that great animation. Whenever you unlock the car, it just gives it that more modern look with the car. And last but not least is my favorite, the midnight purple wrap, which I've done in my garage by myself. Uh, with the help of my wife, of course. I'm really happy with the outcome of this wrap. I was a little bit nervous wrapping this car in my garage. It's just first time I wrapped it, but I'm quite happy with the result. Next is the suspension mods. We've got the Vortland Springs, which lowers the car by 45 mil. We've got Brembo brake pads with the DBA slotted rotors. Also, gone and bought the competition style wheels in the 19 by eight and a half up front and 19 by nine and a half at the back which also is wrapped in the Pirelli P1 tires now this gold colors just suits the midnight purple perfectly and that's the reason why I went with gold as you can see guys the car just looks brilliant in these two color combination so yeah guys, the car is sold. I got good money for it, so I don't see why I wouldn't take that opportunity to have that extra cash. There'll definitely be another car anyway on the channel. You just have to stick around and find out what it'll be. But yeah, that's it for today's video guys. Take care.